Watch until the end of the video if you want to get 60 FPS. Look on the top right and look, look, look. Mm, this is Nintendo Switch, you know what I'm saying? Alright, not only that, I could teach you guys how to get custom FPS. You could get like 45 FPS on here. Look at the top right, 45 FPS. And of course, I'll teach you guys how to edit fast. These best Nintendo Switch settings out here. Let's go get started, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Here I got brightness at 150%. So then you can see one of the storm and all that. Show FPS on. Power saving mode. Have this off. If you want 60 FPS, you have to have it off. If you have it on, then it's going to reduce your Nintendo Switch power. And that's not what you want, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, these are my audio settings. Visualize sound effects. I have this on. So then you can see all around you if there's footsteps and all that. Um, My game settings... My game settings here, uh, I speak English, United States, because I'm Turkish, you know what I'm saying? It's toggle Sprint, I have this on. Auto Open Doors, I have this on. You guys can copy these settings, but you guys don't have to. Disable Pre-Edit Option, have this off. If you have it on, it increases your input delay. And Auto Confirm Edit, set it to both, so then you can not only edit and reset without pressing your Confirm button, but you can do just that, bro. <laughs> Uh, anyways, uh, this FOV thing, I don't even know what it is, to be honest. Game UI, you guys don't need to copy these, but 80% is the best, in my opinion. You guys can set it to, like, sometimes I have it at 125%, so then you guys can see I'm on 60 FPS here. Look, 60 FPS, still on Nintendo Switch, Joy-Con, all that. Press and hold this, boom. You know, I I'm actually on 60 FPS, like, not click B not clickbait all right so yeah that's that's all that you know gyro aiming i have this on this is what i use to like look around and stuff um 60 fps <laughs> why do i keep saying 60 fps all right gyro aiming these are my gyro sensitivities i just have it at 1.9 and then my vertical horizontal ratio at 1.1 to 1 um my, these are my controller settings you know at a whole time have it at 0.250 go all the way down here these are my build edit sensitivities you guys could pause these if i'm going way too fast 43 percent on both my horizontal and look speed you gotta keep it consistent for both of them uh these are my other settings you know aim assist strength i have it at 100 percent but if you use gyro like me then you won't get uh any aim assist at all which kind of sucks but it is what it is you know anyways um these are my controller mapping whatever this is my custom settings uh i have it set to custom of course have jump as b because you know i use gyro so i don't need to use claw or like any of that gross stuff you know what i'm saying um come down here these are my other settings i'm gonna just i'm gonna just let it play Alright, that's it for that, and then here, oh, you guys don't need to copy these settings, but, yeah, 60 FPS, you guys are probably waiting for this one, the most out of all, anything I just said, uh, I'll, I'll teach you guys, alright, basically, to get 60 FPS, you need to get a V1 version switch, the one with this box, not the ones with this box, or the OLED ones, They, you can still hack those and get 60 FPS, but like it'll be a little bit harder because you need to buy something called a mod chip and you have to do things like soldering. It, I don't know. It, it's like a weird, weird process. But anyways, um, anyways, something I do is called overclocking, which is basically uh, maximizing the potential that the Nintendo Switch can play on. So if I if I go here. I, if I go here, if I go here, I have my CPU settings at max because usually it plays on like this, right? Uh, so I have it playing to its like max potential on everything. Like the Nintendo Switch doesn't usually play on these high of settings. 
So this could this so this will drain your battery, but to be honest, it's so worth it. You guys could even overclock it if you want to get better 30 FPS. You guys could have consistent 30 FPS. If I put it down to 30 FPS, you know, it's like super consistent. Like I don't get a single frame drop at all, but like 30 FPS is disgusting. I'm not even gonna lie. Using this for consistent 30 FPS is nice and all. Not gonna lie, but like it's still very disgusting to play on 30 FPS. I'm not even gonna lie. But like, you know, 30 FPS consistent, it's it's not bad, you know. 60 is still better. You guys could also increase it to like 45. 45 is still a big difference because you're putting your FPS up by 50%. But you know. But you know, if you're going to play at 45 FPS, why not just play at 60, you know? Alright, so yeah, what you have to do is something called overclocking. And this is what a modded Nintendo Switch looks like. If I go here into my album, which is like, yeah, I got a whole bunch of like files and stuff that's downloaded into my, into my, into my Nintendo Switch. So yeah, if you guys are going to do this, beware, you guys can get banned. And also... If you do it wrong, you can ruin your switch. So you gotta, you gotta like follow the tutorial properly. Make sure that you guys got the proper Nintendo Switch, so you don't waste your time. Make sure that you got all the settings needed. There's so many things you need to download and do to get these hacks. But if you guys want to learn how to do that, make this video do well. Uh, go, go and subscribe. So then you guys get notified if I make a tutorial because you know you guys seem to want to get 60 FPS very badly It took me 13 hours to get this done So if you guys want a full tutorial all the downloads and everything if this video does well 100% I'll do that or if I get 20k subscribers Then 100% I'll post it. I'll post it at 20k subscribers Anyways, that's gonna be it for the rest of the video. Don't forget to like comment subscribe uh, follow me on Instagram and TikTok and and if you guys have any messages you guys could message me on my instagram anyways yeah um anyways yeah uh anyways yeah that's it for the rest of this video I'll show you guys how to get 60 FPS one day. Y'all will see. And and yeah, you'll need a PC and everything. Anyways, yeah, comment 60 FPS if you want 60 FPS. Comment 60 FPS if you want the video out.